Good morning, Big Warriors. This is Anna, and today is Thursday, November 12, 2020. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behaviors. Please be seated. Remember, warriors, to follow the three W's. Wear your mask, wash your hands with soap, and watch your distance. A few friends have come up with a way to say hello while we are physical distancing. Take a look. Today there will be a home basketball game against Rising Star. Make sure to come and support your basketball team. Warriors, check the school website for spectator guidelines. Attention Warriors, yearbooks are now on sale for $55. Make sure to order your yearbook before the price goes up. You can make your yearbook extra special by adding your name or pictures. Buy it online at www.jostensyearbook.com or give your cash or check to Ms. Harrison's room in 603. If you're going to bring a check, make sure to make it payable to Booth Yearbook. TCBY will start to be sold tomorrow. Bring $2 if you would like to purchase them. Tomorrow's National World Kindness Day. According to the National Day calendar, on November 13th, as part of World Kindness Day, we are encouraged to spread kindness like an infectious cold. We want to share it more than usual because studies show when others observe, observe kindness in action, they are more likely to carry out an act of kindness too. To. Use hashtag World Kindness Day to share on the booth Instagram. Oh no, I don't have enough money. I got you. Thanks, Emmy. Wow, that was so nice. Kindness goes a long way. Don't forget, a warrior is always responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. And now for the character lesson. Good morning, warriors. This is Nico with a few words of wisdom. John Donne was a famous English poet who lived during the 17th century. He attended Oxford University but wasn't allowed to receive a degree simply because he was Catholic. Today, more than four centuries later, religious prejudices continue to divide the human family. Some of the most famous lines John Donne wrote are these, No man is an entire island entire of itself. Every man is a piece of the continent, a part of the main. In other words, none of us truly stand alone. We are all interconnected with each other and the world around us. Today, think about these words from John Donne and be aware of how your actions and attitudes affect the world around you.
Remember, each of us is an important and unique piece of the greater whole of humanity. So something to think about. This is Nico. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. Good morning, Beforeers. This is Cole bringing you the weather for Thursday, November 12, 2020. The high for today will be 76 and the low will be 64 with a 60% chance of rain. Tomorrow there will be a high of 75 and a low of 62 with a 0% chance of rain. Have a great day, Warriors. Good morning, Beforeers. This is Thursday, November 12, 2020. For your entree, you have spaghetti with meatballs with garlic breadsticks, grilled chicken sandwich, and a jammer pack. For your sides, you'll have green beans, steamed carrots, tossed salad with dressing, and a banana. And for your deli choice, you'll have a choice of milk. Welcome to What's Trending, the show that's trending. I'm Bella. I'm Tyson. So today we're going to be talking about the iconic Devil Running phase. This movie was created in 2012, the movie Radio Rebel. Debbie Ryan came from the movie Jesse and the movie Radio Rebel. Now let's go interview people. What do you guys think about the Debbie Ryan? It's dope, bro. It's dumb. It's it's crazy. What do you think about the Debbie Ryan? Um, I think that I mean someone made it and it just became a trend, and that's how it got popular. And I guess it just stuck with everybody. Thank you for watching What's Trending, the show that's trending. See you next week. Bye. Bye. I'm filling out a form at the appreciation station. That's so cool, but who are you appreciating? I'm appreciating all these people that work in our school building. I want to appreciate some of them. Come join me, we can fill out a form. I love honey, but you know what I don't love? People who don't show their appreciation. Go down to the front office on November 9th through 13th during literacy to show your appreciation, Warriors. And there is candy involved. People is asking me what I got on. They be like, hey Brandon, what you got on? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's too hard. Don't worry about it. It's too hard. <laughs>